Cinderella, Cinderella, it's the tale of Cinderella. She's a very pretty maiden, and everybody loves her. Except, of course, her sisters. They're very, very jealous. They treat her like a maid. They make her do their laundry, too. But will she dreams indeed come true for Cinderella? Welcome. Welcome to our tiny kingdom that is home of a beautiful young girl named Cinderella. Here she is now. Cinderella lives here with her evil stepmother and two evil stepsisters named Anastasia and Drizella. Cold, cruel, and jealous. They make Cinderella a servant in her own home. Carry these, Cinderella. Yes, Anastasia. And these. They're starting to leave marks on my beautiful hands. Of course, Drizella. And don't get them dirty. They're brand new. Cinderella, Cinderella, hear the tale of Cinderella. There'll be magic and surprises and dancing and adventure. And don't forget Prince Charming, who's very, very handsome. We'll learn that love will triumph and what magic wants can do as we see dreams and he come true for Cinderella. I'm coming. All right, girls, head inside. It's time for your singing lesson. And you, Cinderella, unpack all of our shopping immediately. <laughs> Good morning, dear. How are you on this fine day? Look at all this sunshine. It's a beautiful day. I don't think I've ever seen you before. What's your name? Don't worry about my name, dear. Do you have any money that you can spare so that I can buy a loaf of bread? I'm afraid not. But if you're hungry, take these berries. I was going to make them into a pie. I couldn't take your berries. Why insist? Thank you, dear. Why? Your hands, they're very rough and dirty. From all the cleaning I do every day, my feet too. My father used to tell me my feet should only be in fine shoes made of glass. What a silly thing to say. <laughs> Where's your father, dear? He died a few years ago. I'm afraid I must be going. Thank you for the berries. As you can see, even through the hard times, Cinderella never stopped hoping that someday her dreams of happiness would come true. I can't possibly start our singing lesson without my tea. Oh, look what you've done now. What? Those better not have been berry muffins. Those are my favorite. Now you've ruined it. Really, Cinderella, you must learn to be more careful. I'm sorry, stepmother. It won't happen again. Indeed. Now, clean this mess up and get to work on your chores. This is love, mm -hmm. so this is love, so this is what makes life divine. 
I'm all aglow And now I know The key to all heaven is mine My heart has wings And I can fly I'll touch every star in the sky So this is the miracle that I've been dreaming of So this is love. Silly, silly Cinderella dancing with her mop. You are so foolish. Cinderella! I need my tea before we can start our singing lesson. Go and get it now. And I need a muffin. Make it two berry muffins. Girls, it's time for your singing lesson. Cinderella, shouldn't you be cleaning something? <laughs> I think today I will have a chocolate chip muffin. But you told Cinderella you wanted blueberry muffins. And when she gives them to me, I will throw them in her face and demand chocolate chip. Ah, the classic bait and switch muffin order. Very effective. Hey, it worked on you last week when I wanted your chocolate ice cream. A letter from the king. Thank you. Have a grand day. It's a letter from the king. The king? Let me see. By royal proclamation, the king declares a royal poll tonight. All unmarried ladies of the kingdom are invited to attend and meet the prince. <gasps> oh, the prince. He is so handsome. I'm unmarried. There's a shock. How dare you? The prince will pick me. Why would he pick you when he can have ah! me? Maybe because the prince wants a mature young lady. Not a crab. Crab? Go shove another muffin down your throat. Girls, girls, can we agree that we'll all be on our best behavior tonight? First impressions are everything. Unless you plan on wearing that hideous green dress again. At least I don't look like I was dressed in the dark. <gasps> Ladies, we're trying to make a good impression here. Oh, don't worry, mother. I'll bring my best manners and my best perfume. Oh, great. The prince will be begging to dance with me because he can't stand your smell. Girls, we're trying to make a good impression here. And besides, it doesn't matter which one of you he picks. We'll all get to live at the palace. No. Oh, I'm oh, I'm I'm May I go, stepmother? <gasps> you? Why on earth would you go? Well, the letter did say all young, unmarried ladies of the kingdom. <laughs> oh, can you imagine? Why, Cinderella, I just love what you've done with your mop. <laughs> Girl, it's not nice to make fun of your sister. It's not her fault she's so unfortunate. Why, of course you can go, my dear, if you get all of your work done. Now come along, girls. We must get to your singing lesson. Cinderella. Perla. Good morning. Cinderella. Susie, how are you? Cinderella. Shock, you look fine today. Now, where's Gus? Come on out, Gus. Don't let them scare you. Cinderella, go to the party? A ball. Can you imagine? Dancing with the prince. It would be a dream come true. Dream, Cinderella. 
How, Gus? Don't you know what a dream is? It's important to have a dream. Hmm. A dream is a wish your heart makes when you're fast asleep. In dreams you will lose your heartache. Whatever you wish for, you keep. Have faith in your dreams and Today, don't forget it's dirty sock day. Oh, girl. Mean, mean, mean. <laughs> it's all right. I'm not going to think about dirty socks. I'm going to think about the ball. All those ladies in their fancy dresses, and all those men in their handsome coats and mustaches, and why, sir, are you asking me to dance? How lovely. A dream is a wish your heart makes when you're fast asleep. In dreams you will lose your heart aches. Whatever you wish for, you keep. Have faith in your dreams and someday your rainbow will come smiling through. No matter how your heart is grieving, if you keep on believing, the dream that you wish will come true. <coughs> Look at the castle. It is so beautiful. I wonder what the prince is doing right now. All the invitations have been delivered, Your Majesty. Thank you. Now, as I was saying, you must be married by your next birthday. I have to find the right girl first. That is why I'm throwing this ball. Is everything prepared? I'll make sure of it, Your Majesty. Perfect. You'll meet her at the ball and fall in love. It's not that easy. That's how I met your mother, and look how happy we were. Father, that may have worked for you, but that is not how it will work for me. And how do you know what will work for you? Because it, it's what I dream about. Dream? You can't spend your life dreaming. I want to retire, and you need to be king. Everyone knows that a good king has a wonderful queen at his side, usually telling him what to do. That's not how I see it. In my dreams, I know the minute I lay eyes on her. Enough with this talk of dreams. You're making me sleepy. Dreams aren't real, but the ball is. Dreams are real. They're your true feelings. And what do your true feelings tell you? I tell you, you'll find your true love in the ballroom. Oh, sure, Dad, because seeing someone at the ball and falling in love immediately is completely realistic. Well, it worked for me. Okay, fine. Maybe it's not the most practical way of finding a soulmate, but it's a good excuse for a party. Oh, joy. A room full of snooty aristocrats vying for my attention. Cheer up, son. Who knows? Maybe you'll meet the woman of your dreams tonight. Or maybe I'll end up dancing with a pumpkin. What are you doing, Cinderella? Dreaming. Do you ever dream? Of course. A wise man once said, all of your dreams can come true if you have the courage to pursue them. What are you dreaming of? I'm dreaming of my father of how happy we were. I miss him. I wish I was happy again. 
You will be Cinderella one day. I hope so. I better get back to my chores. Have a great afternoon. Oh, Cinderella, keep dreaming. All right, girls, let's try the song again. And all things sweet, bright and gay. Well, girls, that was unfortunate. Maybe you'll sound better after some tea. Sing, sweet nightingale, sing, sweet nightingale. Oh. Now what do they want? We're ready for our tea. Now, Cinderella. All right, all right. Poor Cinderella. Every time she finds a minute, that's the time that they begin it. Cinderella, Cinderella. Cinderella. Cinderella, Cinderella, night and day it's Cinderella. Make the fire, fix the breakfast, wash the dishes, do the and the sweeping and the dusting, they always keep her hopping. She goes around in circles till she's very, very dizzy. So they holler, keep a busy Cinderella. Oh, who am I kidding? I'm never going to get done with my chores in time for the ball. Besides, I don't have a thing to wear. Look, a dress for the ball. But it's old. We can fix that. Need things, need things. <laughs> oh, mother, this dress is awful. And the sash is so over. And these beads, really? All I can say is I don't think so. This color is so last season. <gasps> looky, looky. We can do it. It'll be your easy. We can do it, we can do it, we can help our Cinderella. We can make the dress too pretty, there's nothing to it really. We'll tie a sash around it and put a ribbon through it. When dancing at the ball, she'll be more beautiful than all. And the lovely dress we'll make for Cinderella. Hurry, 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 gotta help for Cinderella. We got no time to dilly dally, we gotta get a going. I'll cut it with no scissors. And I can do the sewing. Leave the sewing to the women. You go and get some trimming. And, and we'll, we'll make, make a lovely, lovely dress for Cinderella. Woo! And we'll make a lovely dress for Cinderella. Woo! Ready for the ball? I tried so hard to finish my chores. This is the last one, picking up the groceries. Aren't you going to the ball? No, as you can see, I'm much too old. The invitations are for young ladies. You're not old. You're 
experienced. Thank you, Cinderella. You are so kind. Cinderella! Why? You're not ready, child. I'm not going. <gasps> not going? How unfortunate. <laughs> but of course, there will be other times, Anne. Yes. Well, I better go get your sisters. Do hurry and put the groceries away, dear. <laughs> Cinderella! 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 What are you all doing here? Surprise for Cinderella! For me? What could this be? I don't believe it! How can I ever thank you? It's put, beautiful. Put it on quickly. I will. Cinderella put on her dress as fast as she could, just in time too, because the ball was about to begin. Now girls, when we arrive at the ball, you must catch the prince's eye. He's looking for a wife after all. When the prince chooses me, I'll be the perfect wife. Who said he's gonna pick you? Claude. Girls, doesn't matter which one of you he picks. <sighs> and stop your arguing, the prince will find that unattractive. Now, in order to catch the prince's eye, you must woo him with their smile. Like this, mother? Oh, how beautiful, Anastasia. We'll walk on a floor on the way to the bowl. Now you, Drizella. No, bigger, we must see more gums. Oh, how attractive. The prince will find you irresistible. Oh, what do you know about enchanting gentlemen? Well, dear, I've had many husbands, all of them rich and all of them handsome. I had them all wrapped around my finger. Oh. Yes, mother, teach us your ways of philandering men. All right, listen up. Step number one, make eye contact. Step number two, flutter your eyelids. This will make the gentleman intrigued. Step number three, the walk. This step is very important. You must communicate with the walk that you are a sophisticated young lady without saying a word. Now, you are face to face with the prince. Imagine it. You whisper, your majesty, as you curtsy. Now, pretend I am the prince, mesmerize me. Your Majesty. Well, that will have to do. Our carriage awaits off to the bowl. Wait for me. Isn't it lovely? Don't you think it will do? Why, Cinderella. I don't believe it. Oh, Mother, she can't. She just... After all, we did make a bargain, didn't we, Cinderella? Why, these beads, they give it just the right touch. Don't you think, Drizella? No, I don't think so. I think... Why, you little thief! Those are my beads! Give them here! Oh, no! And my sash... Wearing my sash, give it back! Please stop. You ungrateful we will welcome you into our house and do everything and we've done you for you. Please. Steal Please. from Please. us. You wear your How dare you? We After gave you everything. everything. We help you. Oh, I'm you brat. All right, us. girls. That's quite enough. I don't want you upsetting yourself before the ball. Head outside. <laughs> Why, Cinderella, your dress is ruined. How unfortunate.
Good night, Cinderella. Brave dear, remember, all of your dreams can come true if you have the courage to pursue them. There's nothing left to dream about. Nothing. Nothing? You don't really mean that. I mean, look at me. Most people see an old woman, but not you, Cinderella. You see, how do you say it? Experience? What? What are you? I'm your fairy godmother. That's impossible. Nonsense, child. If that were impossible, I wouldn't be here. And here I am. But you were just, and the dress in your thing, I mean. I got tired of wearing those old rags. This is much more my style. Now, dry those tears. You can't go to the ball looking like that. The ball? Oh, but I'm not. But of course you are. But we'll have to hurry, because even miracles take a little bit of time. Miracles? Really, fairy godmother? Really and truly. Now run along and dry those tears. Let's see. First thing we will need is a pumpkin. Where could I find a pumpkin? Where? <gasps> mm. The bigger one. Oh my goodness. <sighs> Wonderful. Now, let's see. The magic words? Oh, yes. Now, Salika, do the magical boo, bippity boppity boo. Put them together, and what have you got? Bippity boppity boo. Now, Salika, do the magical boo, bippity boppity boo. It'll do magic, believe it or not. Bippity boppity boo. Now, Salika, do the means. Mijikabularu, and the thing on my bob that does the job is bippity boppity boo. Oh, Salkadula, Mijikabula, bippity boppity boo. Put them together, and what have you got? Bippity boppity, bippity boppity, bippity boppity boo. Make a wish and make some more. We'll see what I have in store. Hold a pumpkin in your hand, it turns into a carriage grand. Something's missing, yes, of course. The invitation is the source. Now it's time for the ball. And my favorite trick of all, bippity boppity, boppity boo, a beautiful gown, and some glass slippers too. Now, Saga Dula means Mitchika Boolaroo, and the thing on my bop that does the job is bippity boppity boo. Oh, Saga Dula Mitchika Boola, bippity boppity boo. Put them together and what have you got? Bippity boppity, bippity boppity, bippity boppity boo, boo! Why? It's all like 
a dream. A wonderful dream come true. Yes, but I must let you know, all good things come to an end. This spell lasts till midnight. Midnight? Oh, thank you, fairy godmother. Yes, but you must understand. On the stroke of 12, the spell will be broken, and all will be as it was before. I understand. Oh, look at this beautiful dress, and on my feet, glass slippers, just like my father would have wanted for me. Yes. Now, run along and say hello to the prince for me. Bippity boppity, bippity boppity, bippity boppity boo. Ever gonna pick you with that big nose of yours? Do I hear something? I think someone's talking, but I'm not sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep talking. One of these days you might actually say something intelligent. You're sharp as a marble, aren't you? Girls, that's quite enough. Now, come along. We must practice your curtsies. Oh, like she has to bother. One look at you, and the prince will go running. How do I look? Well, mirrors can't talk, and lucky for you, they can't laugh either. Oh, take that back right now, you stupid ninny. Muffin head! Girls, the king is about to speak. Thank you all for coming. I present to you his most excellent and royal highness, my wonderful son, the prince. <gasps> Thank you all for coming. Now, we would love to meet each and every one of you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Way. Move, my way! Go! 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 Know how go, much go, money go, I go, have? Go. Get out of me my way. first! No. Why, your majesty. Oh, you are so handsome. And your eyes are just dazzling. Nice to meet you. He's got my eyes, you know. Like in a jar? Hello, handsome. May I touch your hair? What? Uh, it's so perfect all the time. You must use lots of gel in it. And it smells wonderful. You may not touch my hair. What about my hair? You're balding. Uh, don't worry, son. You'll find a girl tonight. Don't count on it. I don't even like to dance. <gasps> Would you like to dance? Why, thank you, your highness. Yes, yes, hit it, maestro. Who is she? Do we know her? There's something familiar about her. <gasps> and look what she's wearing on her feet. Are those glass slippers? Glass.
What's your name? Oh, um, this is a lovely ball. Oh, yes, yes it is. Uh, now that you're here, where do you live? I live in the countryside, not too far from here. Well, I could just dance with you all night. My, that would be lovely. Midnight, oh my goodness. What's the matter? It was so nice meeting you. No, wait. It's midnight, I have to go. How will I find you? I don't even know your name. Oh, oh I... I'm right here, honey. And I'm not going anywhere. No, stop that girl. Where could she have gone? Where's the Grand Duke? Here, sir. Organize a search right party. Right away, sir. Everyone, look for that girl. She is gone, Prince. I have no way to find her. How about this? She dropped it on her way out. This, this is it. How can that help us? We'll try it on every girl in the kingdom. Come on, not a moment to waste. an evening. Oh, I know. The prince spent all night dancing with that horrible girl in blue. She reminded me of a blueberry muffin. Enough with your muffin obsession, Anastasia. It is not an obsession. I don't understand why you like muffins so much. Everyone knows they're just ugly cupcakes. You're an ugly cupcake. That didn't even make sense. I would call you stupid, but that would be an insult to stupid people. Mother, make her stop. The statement applies to both of you. What were you thinking? You ruined our chances of living in a palace. <laughs> we were just doing what you taught us to. Poorly. Mother, I thought you said the prince would find me irresistible. No, the matter. What's done is done, and I'm very disappointed in you. She means you. Well, I can keep my chin up. I know I'm mother's favorite. I think you mean chins, plural. Well, I can lose weight, but you'll always be ugly. Enough, girls. Cinderella. There you are. Clean our dresses immediately. Make sure you get out all of the wrinkles and the food stains. Yes. How was the ball? It was wonderful. The prince danced with me all night. Liar. You were at the buffet all night. I was not. The prince loved me. No, he loved me. 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 Oh, I was the one he was in love with. You could tell. No. <sighs> me. It's all about me. It's all about what I want and need to be. When I walk out the door and down the street, I want the world to see a wonderful, sweet, and humble, kind, adorable me. Me. It's all about me. It's all about my sweet personality. So keep me happy, keep me pleasant, so the whole wide world can see a cute little bubbly, caring, kind, affectionate me. 
I don't want much. My tastes are simple yet refined. A dress to wear that really makes me look divine. And new shoes made of velvet. And my hair all up in bows. My needs are very basic. Has anyone who knows me? I'm talking about me. It's all about me. Just sweet little me. It's all about what? What I, I want and need to be. When I walk out the door and down the street, I want the world to see a wonderful, sweet, and humble, kind, adorable me. I'm very modest, but I think that everyone deserves to see a cute little bubbly, caring, kind, affectionate me. Wonderful me, 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 marvelous me, 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 sweet little me. Enough, girls. Cinderella, before you go to bed, I want you to clean our dresses, then go upstairs and clean the attic, then down to the cellar. But that'll take all night. Come, girls. You need your beauty rest. Some of us more than others. I'm glad you're finally noticing. Well, you... She can be so mean sometimes. There you are. Why did you run off? Because the prince would see the real me. Is that so bad? Look at me. I'm looking, and you're beautiful. I'm not. But thank you. I need to go clean the attic. Cinderella cleaned all through the night as the king, the prince, and the grand duke searched and searched to find the girl that fit the slipper. But you see, I made those glass slippers to fit Cinderella alone. They knocked on every door in the kingdom and couldn't find the girl until they got to Cinderella's house. This is it, the far end of the kingdom, the last house. She has to be here. Maybe she came in from another kingdom. She's here. I know it. Welcome, 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 your majesty and your majesty. May I present to you my daughters, Drizella and Anastasia. Your grace. Let's just get this over with. Quick, get Cinderella, get Cinderella. Why, that's my slipper. No, it's uh, my slipper. No, Cinderella's slipper. It's mine. Mine! 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 Girls! Mind your manners. I'm sure you've had a long night, Your Grace. Can I get you anything? Maybe a hot tea? No, thank you. A fresh muffin? Let's just try this on. Right. Anastasia, dear. <laughs> oh, see, it fits! Oh. I knew this was my slipper. It's my exact size. I always wear the exact same size. When I saw it, I thought, oh, there's that slipper you lost. Your foot is too big. Well, um, maybe it's a little snug today. You know how it is after a night of dancing. 
the next young lady. Get out of my chair! It fits! It fits? Well, we'll make it fit. No, no, no. Are there any other young ladies in the house? No, no one else. Well then, good day. Your Grace. Your Highness. May I try it on? Oh, pay no attention to her. She's only Cinderella. She is the maid. Works in the barn. She doesn't count. She's very smelly, hardly a person. Yeah, I mean, look at her. Ugh. We shall try it on every girl. I'm not sure she even is a girl. Allow me. Oops. <laughs> Why, it shattered into a million pieces. Sorry, son. Now we'll never know. Cinderella, go sweep that mess up. You heard your sister. Poor Cinderella. No hope. No hope. Don't be silly, my friends. There is always hope. <gasps> Excuse me, your highness. <gasps> the other slipper! <gasps> Thank you. We shall try this on now. You. It's you. Yes, it's me. We probably should have started on this end of the kingdom. Then it wouldn't have taken all night. Cinderella, won't you come back to my palace with me? Oh, yes. I would love that. No, Cinderella. We're a family and family. Sticks together after all. I thought I was just the maid who worked in the barn. Oh, and you better learn to cook <gasps> and to clean oh. because I quit. Oh, no, Cinderella, we need you. Oh. How? Unfortunate. Oh. Today. You made my dreams come true. It wasn't me. You did it. You made all of your dreams come true by having the courage to pursue them. Cinderella, uh, I don't believe we ever got to finish our dance at the ball, did we? Well, no, I don't believe we did. May I? I would love that. So the prince and Cinderella danced and danced and lived happily ever after. Cinderella, Cinderella. We had magic and surprises and dancing and adventure. We got to meet Prince Charming, who's very, very handsome. Now we will got to singing one more time before we're through as we see dreams indeed come true for Cinderella. A dream is a wish your heart makes when you're fast asleep. In dreams you will lose your heartaches, whatever you wish for you keep. Have faith in your dreams and someday your rainbow will come smiling through. No matter how